so welcome all so in this video we are learning calculate aging in excel by using x lookup formula instead of if so generally in excel we have to also calculate the aging and we are using if formula we are adding very lengthy formula instead of this we can use the x lookup which will do your work 10x faster so you want to learn that so get ready with that we will learn so first we will understand that where we are using if formula suppose this is my database and these are my invoices due and these are the days for which they are due and i have to calculate these days into this period that these days into that aging that this month is overdue for that much year so that is so much period so how to get it here so general tendency people are using if or if as formula I will share the description of that if you don't know how to use ifs formula you can use that here generally we type the logical test if this value is greater than and equal to suppose if i have to know greater than nine here i will use three two four one then this will give me this result then again second logical test if this value is greater than and equal to my second criteria two eight eight one then this is equal to eight to nine years and again again and again and see it will take lot of time if suppose in a mid anyone say no 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 change the period from two to five year five to ten i will say again i have to write the if formula so don't again type the if formula just i just close this formula i will show you where, why and here it will be this sorry I'm just adding only three arguments here. So whatever if value is not found, if value is three, two, four, four, it will give me the, but for that I have to give all this details. So instead of this, you can use X lookup for calculating this aging. So you will understand how I will look up this value for this. So X lookup has a, some benefit in it that you can use it. So we will learn that just pay attention to it what i am typing here i will type x lookup my lookup value is this lookup array i have to calculate from this days but still 3244 it not here it is 3241 it will not search for this comma and the return array i require this value if i just close it like this it will give not error that it has not found 3244 in this table so i asked him to found if 3244 not found go to the next smallest match so if you see in x lookup syntax there is after this there is one syntax if not found right now i'm not using it if there is a second is match mode so here if i type zero i will get the exact match if i type minus one exact match and next smallest item so that's way i want right now so i will select minus one if i close the bracket here what i will get see the result if i just i have to just freeze this also if not found i will manually give him give this result one two three months sorry or manually i will type one two three months for not found so whenever there is an error or it will give me the result of one two three months click enter now just if i copy paste this formula i will get the result see it's working i just copy paste in all the cells and i am getting my aging criteria here let's test it 1701 4 to 5 year so yes it will be 4 to 5 year because it is between in this years so see just a simple formula i get my result here even if i don't i will just check if i don't type here will it give me the result it's not giving me the result because it's not able to find the next lowest match so i have to type if zero here it will work so you can do by this way also and i will prepare my pivot of this just refresh it i get my detail 
as soon as early i will prepare my report as soon as possible so hope you like this video please subscribe to my channel i think i will come up with all more interesting videos like this thanks for watching this video